Welcome to the CA UIM email auto operator video. In this video, I will show you how to create an auto operator profile that sends emails when an initial alarm occurs. As a CA UIM product administrator, you may need to quickly alert operators when an alarm occurs. To solve this issue, you can create an auto operator profile that sends an email when an alarm is received. Auto operators are rules that determine how alarms are processed in the NAS probe. Before I can create my new auto operator, I will have to deploy and configure the email gateway probe. The email gateway probe forwards the alarms that NAS sends as email messages. In this example, I have already logged into Admin Console, deployed the email gateway probe, and opened the email gateway probe configuration menu. In the email gateway probe configuration menu, there are several optional parameters that I could set to customize my email alarm messages. For more information about these options, refer to the Email Gateway Probe documentation. In this video, I will focus on configuring your email server and creating a new profile. First, I will add the credentials for my email server. The Email Gateway Probe will use these credentials to send my alarm emails. I start by clicking on the Mail Server node. I will enter the credentials for my email server in the Primary Mail Server section. If you do not know what to enter, the administrator for your email server can provide the required credentials. If necessary, I could also enter the credentials for a secondary email server. Alarm emails are sent from this email server if the primary server is unavailable. Now that I have entered the credentials for my email server, I need to configure a profile. Profiles are used to determine who will receive alarm emails. To create a new profile, I click on the ellipses next to the profile node and select Add Profile. The Add Profile window opens. Here, I can add the email address for the user that will receive the alarm emails. Make note of the profile name. I will need this when configuring the NAS Auto Operator later. There are also several optional parameters here that I could use to customize the type of emails that are sent. For more information about these options, refer to either the Email Gateway User Documentation or the knowledge base articles available at support.ca.com. After entering the information for the user, I click Submit. I am then prompted to restart the email gateway probe. After the email gateway probe reloads, my new test profile appears under the Profiles node. Now that I have configured the email gateway probe, I can configure an auto operator profile in NAS that sends alarm emails to the profile that I specify. Note that I must use Infrastructure Manager to complete this step. First, I open Infrastructure Manager and locate the NAS probe. I then right click on the NAS probe and select Configure. When the NAS GUI opens, I click on the Auto Operator tab. The Auto Operator tab contains a list of the available auto operators. To create a new auto operator, I right click in the window and select New. The profile window opens and I can start creating my new email profile. I start by changing the action type to Email. This opens additional options below the Action Type dropdown. I add the name of the profile that I created in the Email Gateway Probe to the Recipient tab. Note that this field also supports a single email address or a list of email addresses. Generally, we recommend using a profile when you want to send email to more than one user. I then change the action mode to On Message Arrival. Next, I change the message counter to equals with a value of 1. This ensures that the user only receives an email the first time an alarm occurs. Now that my profile is complete, I click OK. I can now enter a name for my profile. I enter one and click OK. My new profile now appears in the Profiles tab. By default, my new profile has a checked box next to the profile name. This indicates that the profile should be activated when the NAS probe restarts. Now, I click Apply and select Yes when prompted. My new profile now has a green play icon next to it. This means that the profile is now active and running. For more detailed information about NAS and auto operators, refer to the CA DocOps platform or visit the CA UIM community to join in the discussion. The links can be found in the YouTube description located below this video.